Good Lord, Brian, did you see Game of Thrones this week? Is Mrs. Fields my downfall? Yes. Oh my God, so at the beginning, Game of Thrones is giving me that, like a lifeguard show everyone's been waiting for. Broadwatch. <laughs> Christina is recruiting pledges for her sorority, Fry Dragon Dragon. I'm not here to murder. All I want to destroy is the wheel that has rolled over rich and poor. Ooh, but that dick on honey, he is a Lannister legacy and he is not going nowhere. I haven't seen a dick on burn like that since the gonorrhea outbreak of 2011. Maybe I've been spending too many Sunday afternoons watching cable, but Christina and Jon Snow were serving up Hallmark movie realness. She's a single mom looking for someone to love her and her three dragons and turn their dragon stone into a dragon home. But will she be able to extinguish a former flame? Heartbreaker of chains. And then maybe Kill Bill is all the shades grossed out when she finds out where Sansa Fierce has been sleeping. He's a mother and father's chambers. And sleeping in your parents' bed. Who probably used like sex toys, anal, vaginal, no rinsing, no wet wipes, just puss butt, puss butt, puss butt. Thinking the Holy Spirit's gonna keep you safe? No, it doesn't. You ties are coming for everyone. And you know what? I don't think there's cranberry juice or pills back no, in those back days. back then, they would just kill you. And then of course, Hooked on Phonics gets invited to the gender reveal party and surprise, we're having a blacksmith. Hooked on Phonics was giving me straight Maxine, everyone's favorite shoebox greeting, diva. Yeah, nobody mind me. All I've ever done is live to a ripe old age. Nothing fucks you harder than time. It's better to be a coward for a minute than dead for the rest of your life. Ooh, but then we find out which way gendry fluid be swinging, honey. Time. Ooh, honey, I be smelling some trouble and incested ice when Brother D tells Vintage Mia Farrow that he had a little baby meeting with Munchers, but she took it really well. I met with Tyrion. What did your brother have to say? And then breaking news, we find out from Busted Anne Hathaway that Jon Snow is no bastard. I mean, he is in fact the legitimate heir to the Iron Throne, which you know that means that he can Sorry, not- can we talk about Tubby Lubby and how he shot that avant-garde perfume commercial in the library? Books are meant to be touched. Learning is sex. Tube Lube, reach for the forbidden. So then back at Winterfell, Baby Kill Bill suspects that Earl Grey's up to no freaking good, so she makes like Jessica Fletcher and Cabot Coves this motherfucker. But of course she's been had because Earl Grey's just a messy bitch who lives for drama. And then at the end, we had Riley and Louis C.K., who I am now calling Surly Spice, playing Guess Who? Ice and Fire Edition. And you need to convince the one with the dragons or the one who fucks her brother. And they're giving me full Moulin Rouge, Lady Marvel. You got Doug the Bounty Hunter, Man Bun, Bell Collins, Gendry Fluid, Surly Spice, Jon Snow, Sir Carlisle. And even though they all have different singing styles and then whatever little Kim does, they band together to hunt them a White Walker. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Mulan Rouge. <laughs> Look, I know you didn't want this big of a change, but I just knew if I pushed, you could serve me dick on realness. I, I honestly feel like if I go home and my husband sees me, he's not gonna recognize me. Growth doesn't happen when you're comfortable. How much do I owe you for this? It's 350. Okay. Yeah. $350. Yes. Got it. Yeah. Well worth it. I know. It looks great. Yeah. Where are my dragons? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Sometimes you're paying for what you don't get. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, I know how to not make Right, like I came in here being like, I'd like a haircut. Is that what you do? And you said, sure. And then it didn't happen. Well, I told you you didn't need one so right. much. Right. So, so, but this is my time. But I'm caught up on a show that I don't watch. Yeah, so. and it's my time. So yeah. it, you have to pay for my time. 